Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Storytime with Chief Katie. I hope you all are having a great day. Today, I am excited to bring to you another dinosaur book, A Friend in the Wild by Brandy Daughtry. Arlo has a friend in the wild, Spot. Spot taught Arlo how to survive. Arlo showed Spot how to thrive. They take good care of each other. Making your way in the world, here are some tips. Build yourself a good, sturdy shelter. That's a good idea that keeps the rain off of you. Gather food. Not only is it essential for survival, it's fairly easy once you get a hang of it. Because we need food to live. Look for fresh water. You'll be surprised by what you can find. Stay alert in case of danger. You never want to be caught off guard. Oh, look at that dangerous snake. Be sure to learn your plants. You'll be glad you did. Because some plants can make us itchy. Got to make sure we stay away from those plants. Along with the basics like food, water, and shelter, always have a friend by your side. A friend like Spot. When an obstacle gets in your way, work together to overcome it. Oh, look at Spot help make a bridge. Get to know your friend by heart. The more you know, the better. Always good to know your friend. A friend can help you weather a storm. Don't forget to have fun. Friends are good for being with them and having fun. You never know who might meet in who you might meet in the wild. Be open to adventure. And wonder. It's always good to dream and wonder what else you can do. Make sure you have a way to find each other in case you get lost. So they made calling for each other. They call each other by going, oh, woo. If you're having trouble seeing in the dark, light your way. Look at that. Look at all the fireflies. Fireflies can light the way. At the end of a long day, find a comfy spot to curl up. A friend in the wild will help you stay safe and warm. Good luck. The end. This was a great book. It teaches you that having a friend is always good to have for they can help you through things. They can help you find some each other if you get lost. And you can also help you find food, water. And it, to me, a good friend is always one to have fun with. And to play, that's the best of a good friend. So 
I hope you enjoyed story time today. Tune in next time as we have another great book. Hope you all have a good day. Bye.